Fucking four kill as well. Like four kill was greedy and like super, super risky. Like four kill was very greedy and super risky, but we fucking pulled it off, man. That was savage. That was beautiful. <laughs> How you do an object of depression? Why do I feel like I've seen your name? I mean, that it might be quite a common pun. Obviously not, I don't mean that offensively, but I've seen that name very recently in a Dead by Daylight match, I swear. Unless that's purely a fucking coincidence, I don't know. He got away somehow, that's impressive. Would want to work four days though? Yeah, there was a lot of talk about that four day week shit going on, right? Wasn't there like a lot of talk about four day weeks and stuff happening and, or trying to happen? I've got an add-on on that increases the range at which I can send that guard on a path, man. I've got an add-on on that increases it. And I still can't make it to that gen. That's how nerfed Knight is, man. Can't make it to that gen from there. That's so bad. This guy didn't give a shit about me. That's cool. I'm making pay for that. God damn, I'm hoping he tries to bless a totem or do something up there. Maybe tries to vault or something. I oh, know he's blesses and then jumps. That's crazy. If he vaults though, it goes straight up for him, right? Yeah. Pretty good. God got a nice hit there on him. He's really trying to take advantage of that boon totem, man. Really trying to take advantage of that boon totem, bless him. That boon totem's in a horrible position, though, dude. Horrible position. Tame the heavy base. Thank you so much for the follow, man. How you doing today? Um, what a day, what a lovely day. Where the hell did no dire come from? What was it? It may have been me. Yeah, I swear it was object of depression. I swear I saw that name very recently in the game. I don't think it was like tonight, but it was definitely last night, I think. Uh, but no, how you guys doing, man? Thanks so much for coming by and saying hello. I appreciate it. This boon totem's in a really horrible place. I really, really fucking wish that you could, um, send a guard to go and kick a boon, man. That would be so good. It'd be really good. I'm doing good, though, man. Played some good games tonight. Played some night. Played some artists. I haven't played artists since she released. It's quite nice to get back into artists again, to be honest with you. It's really nice to get back into her and win some games. We won, like, three in a row. That was quite handy. And now I'm just playing some night again, because I love night. That's my boy. Even though he's not very good, obviously. I'm real condemned build. Are you like going condemned farming? Are you? What's your build right now? Have you got like a very specific one that's working out for you? And I'm kind of like trying to aggressively pursue this dude. I think. Sorry, that's so quiet. My volumes have been messed up on those. That gives us haste that we need right now. You can almost only see one survivor. True very true good switch man he switched that around quite nicely did he take the hit with dead hard perhaps oh that was a mistake right he gets hit for that yeah he gets hit for that um yeah i mean generally there's I think there's quite a lot of killer streamers there's definitely more survivors though for sure um but how's your Omrio condemned build looking depression what's the perks looking like right now tame as well are you a killer main are you a survivor main what did you get up to Trying to heal, man. That's very cheeky. I reckon we pursue the chase up here, right? Yeah. Not reacted to that, man. No chance. No chance of reacting to that at all. No chance. Bring drawing fingernails for add-ons. Face the darkness. Nurse is calling. Ball of brand eruption, that's really cool. Do you not have sloppy in there then? I always feel like with those kind of like anti-healing builds in a way where you want them to heal. Oh, then again, I guess you do want them to heal, right? Because that gives a condemned and then I guess that makes sense. I don't know where these guys are going. Are they running around back? I guess so. No? That's interesting. We'll get the guard to chase. He'll come around to the middle building, I guess. 
Killer main, you survivors. How long have you played Killer for, dude? How long have you played Killer for, and how did you get into it in general? Did you, um... How did you get into playing Killer? Most people get into the game by playing Survivor, I find. Because even I did, really. I'm wanting the heal, it's fair. If he's worried about me coming this way, he wants to get back on the gen. No pallet here, that's pretty handy. I'm not mad at that. Like, you know. No dead hard, man. That, oh, he's still got... Wait, how? Oh. Syringe, maybe? Nice. Alright, so start playing DVD. That's insane. And we went to text your stream already gold at Killer. Oh, that's fucking amazing, Minwaka. That's awesome, dude. If you can watch streamers and get tips like that and improve your gameplay, it's fucking badass. You love to hear that shit. Yeah, I mean, we basically can't let him heal with this boon totem now. They're getting pretty comfortable. Yeah, I like the knight sword, man. The knight can go over the walls like that. It's pretty handy. Are we hearing footsteps there? What are we hearing? With a med kit too? It's kind of weird. Wasn't confident now. It's fair enough. We'll get a guard up there. I did kind of want to go and kick the gen. But I figured the pickup would be really quick, man. And that was a really quick pickup. I guess Boon Totem probably helps. Nice. Didn't react to it. Couldn't react to it. Make sure you don't have a tower radius so that way Face of Darkness doesn't mess up the healing. It's cool, man. I like it. I like it very much. Where did you start playing there, DVD though, Tame? Same with your object as well, man. Like, how did you get into Killer? Did you just see some advertisements or something? Go, yeah, that's for me, that. That's another, um, that's another uh, boon totem up here, I think. So I need to get a gen kicked and then go and get the boon, I think. Four months ago? Nice. What happened though? Like, how did you, you know, most people kind of get in a place of I with their friends, you know? Most people get told to play with their, you know, their friends tell them to come play and then, you know, they kind of get roped in that way. I feel like I need to take advantage of this hook considering the obsessions on the hook. So I need to take advantage of the hook. I don't know why you wouldn't pursue the hook there. Should do. Someone's got to go up top, right? No, outside instead. Nice, good shit. Panic drop, question mark. Ooh, good fucking reaction speed, dude. Ooh, nearly. There you go. There we go, second stage. Yeah, Bill's got the garden now. Has to take that hit. Join when Plague was added. Nice, Plague's really cool. Have you played much of Plague, or is it just you joined when that happened? Always have problems with 3-6 rotation survivors, mate. Thanks to Killer Streamers, that's history. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, it's not really an issue when you know it's kind of coming, you know? It's not really a problem for the most part. Hopefully they catch him in the mid-heal. That's what I'm hoping. I don't think I'll stay around this hook. I think I'll um, skim around to make it look like I might possibly be camping again and then try and make him pay for a gen here. Maybe the same boon. Not the same boon. This guy, I think, is dead hooked, though. I should have pursued him a lot earlier, and I didn't. That was my fault. Where's well, he gonna stay? No. Fair game. I think we catch him again. Good play. Still got a pallet here as well. I think he's still got dead hard also. Yeah, there you go. He's dead hard. Classic. Classic. He drops down, right? Oh, I don't like that. I couldn't fucking drop straight down. Where'd the other guy go, though, man? Where'd the injured guy that's almost dead go? There he is. No, it's not him. That's interesting. So where's the boon totem, man? Where's the fucking boon totem? It's back upstairs again? Dude. What a fucking nightmare totem this really is, man. This is such a nightmare totem. Like, it's an awful location. This is fucking dreadful. Look how long this takes me to get to it. Like, they can all heal by the time I, like, get to it, you know? Just on a regular walk, man. That's ruthless. That's so strong, man. So fucking strong. Such a big range, too, you know? It's not even a tiny range. No progress there. That's really interesting. 
Build panic. That's always good. Learned about DVD from a friend. Nice. So I guess like your friend was like, hey, you need to play this. Killer's so great. You need to come do it. You know, I think he's literally just re-blessed the same totem. And I'm not going to lie to you. Armrio and Ghostface? Oh, no, it's not the same. Oh, never mind. Armrio and Ghostface? Yeah, man. Ghostface got me into Killer. That's a really weird lock on there. That's a weird lock on from that guard. I don't know how that happened. Another boom totem's up, so we probably need to make him pay for uh, this hook. We have to make him suffer for this hook now. No. Nothing there. Which way do I want to come for the unhook though, right? That's the real question. I'm going to try and kick this gen again. It's always funny to do. That's good. Deadlock's in play. We're going to have Obsession. Oh, the Obsession's on the hook, man. That's such a shame. I kind of don't want it to be a thing, to be honest. Good get past. Oh damn, dude. I figured Dead Hard was coming. I don't actually know if Nia's got Dead Hard, bro. He hasn't. That's good. Nice. We have to really just keep this middle of the map now, man. Keep pressure on it. They've got a nice boom totem to use repeatedly, so... Just keep pressure on the to on the map. I don't know where the totem is. That's the problem. I think they probably did it out back on the far back left, to be honest. I think that's what they probably did. I don't think they've started another gen now to be confident enough to like run off and do that gen. So I think we just keep pressure on this hook now. And they've got to go and restart a gen, I think. Yeah, they're going to want to get away and heal. So we just need to keep pressure on here. I saw them vaults from up top as well. That guard should go through the floor and go for them. I don't suspect them to be at that gen, man. I'll be very surprised if they are. I feel like they're probably going to like double heal and totem it up, you know? Um, I might send the guard out. This might cost the unhook here, though. Okay, yeah, good. Yeah, good unhook, man. Need to get this guy dead now, so I'm going to have to tunnel. And just hope that that guard did enough over there. Nice, good movement. It's got off the record, though. Got off the record. What a bastard. Off the record was nice. This guy's nearly dead though, so we use this to our advantage here. We just don't let him round this gen, essentially. Good body block. Where's he gonna go from there though? Out left, right? Interesting. Shit. That's a fuck up by me. Fucking boon totem, man. It's upstairs. I've got no chance of getting that. Literally no chance. That's fucking vicious, dude. Absolutely vicious, man. What a ruthless fucking totem. What a ruthless totem that is. Jesus. I don't have time to go and get it. Like, I literally don't have time, you know? And because he's on Mori as well, they just protect the shit out of him after I hit him once. Savage. Good play. As long as they keep shift W in, that's it, man. I'm nerfed, you know? I'm, like, super nerfed. Although, I don't think he shift W, did he? Where did he go? That's so interesting. Yeah, he's fucked now. Good, uh, good shit. Oh, he's got dead hard, though. He's good. Powerful, man. That's powerful. He's got a pallet here as well. That's bad. Nice. Adrenaline, possibly. No, good. At least we're trying to get the Mori kill on the on Bill. We just need to remember Bill's the obsession. Um, keep nerfing killer perks. Yep, fell asleep watching YouTube. Woke up with DVD videos playing that caught my interest. That's awesome, though, man. That's really cool. You love to see that. We're straight on the gate as well there, so that's unfortunate for those dudes. It's unfortunate that guy died in the end. We just need to catch a, a glimpse of Bill, dude. Catch a glimpse of Bill. That's all we need. Check the other gate. Nah, no one's going to be the other gate, right?
There he is. There's the plonker. We get him and we also have Remember Me as well. I don't know if he's already fucking Death Hook though, man. He is. Oh well. Punishing Endgame? I swear no other mechanical instead of Rancor, but at the same time, we get the value from that. And we still have Remember Me as well. Let's build dead. We're in a different game if we didn't have Rancor there. No other would have caused the same issue, but. Nice, man. Now the panic sets in. Like, get a fucking other gate open, bro. Get another gate open. Get both gates. Oh, God. You should have definitely gone for the other gate, my dude. Shit, you know. Definitely needed to go for the other gate there. I reckon he circles right, man. I reckon as weird as it is, the gate's on the other side. I think he circles right. Yeah. Weird. He seemed, They seem very happy and confident in this area, you know? He's happy with this loop. You know what I kind of want to do, man? If I can catch him, I kind of want to go for the four kill. This is so stupid, though. This is so greedy. But I want to go for it, man. If I catch some scratch marks here. Oh, I did. Amazing. That's so funny. Because all he can really do is come back around. If there's no unbreakable, then we're in a good spot. I mean, get a cheeky four kill here, man. Your shit. Hang on a second, R2. That's mean. A bit offensive. Yeah, circle round, run up. So he's going to have to go for the gate with Remember Me, which is going to be pretty tough. Because um, he either goes for the gate here or, you know, like, he goes for the other gate. Yeah, he needs to get this one open. He's going to have to go for Hatch, man. He's going to have to go for Hatch there. Yeah, nice. Good movements. Good movements. Abandon the gate with a big progress. Makes sense. You have to go for hatch here. Let's get downstairs, man. Amazing. We kind of knew where he was as well. He was kind of like at these back stairs here. No gate there. It's tricky now because... We can definitely do some good movement out back. You could finesse this quite nicely. We just need like a fucking jailer, man. We just need a fucking jailer right now. Yeah, good movement. I still think there's enough extra seconds on the door to cause a problem, though. I think with Remember Me and Play, man, there's enough extra seconds there to cause an issue. Which is good for me. That's it. Four kill, man. That's fucking beautiful from that game, you know? Beautiful. There's no way he tries to finesse. He does, yeah, he can finesse. That's good. Good shit. Nice. We'll know where he's going. Like We'll know where exactly he's going, you know, based on the guard, man. We can just keep him in that corner, to be honest. If he goes upstairs, he goes upstairs, but I think we just keep him in that corner. <laughs> now he's like, yeah, I'm so good at chasing, man. This guy can't even get me. That's great. I'll finesse him all day. Nope. Nope. Wow, what a game to lose. Plonkers. 42 carat plonkers. <laughs> that was a hell of a game to win, man. Hell of a game to win. Very, very close. Very, very close. It's good, though, man. I haven't played any Plague tonight, to be fair. I could do the Plague game. Could do the Plague game. Yeah, it was looking dire, man. It was looking dire there for a second, but we really recovered it. Keeping the obsession alive was crucial to getting that one hit down definite at the end. Like, keeping him alive there instead of making sure he died was good. Um, good tries, you know? Played a Bubba game, got Cow Shed, and absolutely finessed them. They brought two Cold Wind offerings. Fucking hell. What build are you running on the Bubba, R2? Hell of a play, man. Cowshed's really good for survivors and really bad for Bubba, really. Really, really bad. 
bum, 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 bum. Lovely jubbly. That was a beautiful game, man. Absolutely beautiful comeback. Fucking four kill as well. Like four kill was greedy and like super, super risky. Like four kill was very greedy and super risky, but we fucking pulled it off, man. That was savage. That was beautiful. Um, the most important thing there was making sure Bill got a lot of progress to make them come over and get a bit chaotic. But keeping Bill alive for the end game uh, rankle was, was really good, like security blanket for them, like a false confidence, which is really good. Um, got the Bill down, got the Mori there. That was lovely, man. That was very good. Is there a salty boy? Uh, camping all game with zero map pressure is a close game, and you can't even camp properly. I mean, I got a four kill. <laughs> so, I mean, yeah, I would say close, man. You know, four kill, risky. Um, shouldn't have got the four kill, really, to be honest with you. Shouldn't have got it, but that was uh, them making silly mistakes. Silly plays uh, combined with my, you know, IQ, man. Combined with my game sense there. They made silly plays. Game sense kicked in. Uh, four kill in a game that should have been probably a two kill, I would say. Um, not a good map for Knight uh, at all. And that boon totem was very, very powerful as well very very strong and the biggest crutch i've seen for a while was that boon totem that was a hard carry boon 100 uh without that different game but it's amazing man like one perk especially on rpd really really powerful in certain situations there it shows you shows you what it is